So hello everyone and uh, today I'll be speak on the topic take it easy and have fun. Um, this one is a big change in my world. Uh, so take it easy and have fun is just really simple. Um, most of the time when we grow up in life here, we generally get very critical and judgmental on ourselves. Uh, it can be when we learn things. Um, when we read a book and we judge ourselves very harshly and we, we be very critical of ourselves um, in many, many ways. So there will be the inner self-talk that would happen. There will be being more conscious aware of other people talking to us about how we are doing, how we are progressing in our tests or homework and etc. And it isn't exactly taking it easy. So take it easy, um, why it comes down to this is that taking it easy is so important. Um, one of the fundamental uh, key points that Source and my spiritual family was guiding me is uh, going through life uh, from the point of power. So from the point of power is where you access uh, the truth, divine truth, power, what is really true and what can really empower and grow you and expand you um, rather than diminish your value or see the lack and um, in you that is not really true. It can be in you, in situations, in other people. So when we focus on power and when we grow from this, we really see growth, we see expansion, we see um, unlimited potential in a lot of different ways. So take it easy and have fun is uh, stems from this, so it comes from this. And what it means by taking it easy and have fun is, um, so it is like when you want to learn a challenging move, for example, I came upon this um, sort of motto, this uh, saying when I was learning yoga. So yogas, there are different type of moves and I know that even when people don't do yoga, it's a move when, where you connect really strongly. It's pretty difficult and it's called the split. So where you will do the splits and a lot of people who have never done dancing, gymnastics, aerobics class, you'll find this so challenging and a little crazy to do. So when I got into yoga, I would go through different cl classes and teachers would you know be a little difficult on how are they going to teach other students other people who don't have uh, the flexibility uh, the the, uh, the uh, what do you say the learnings are able to do that move and they would be challenge on how to get them into that position and still engage that level of learning on how to uh, the level of skill the move the learning to actually do that activity of the split so uh, how I uh, from together with source and a spiritual family when I learn yoga is really taking it easy and have fun if the move and it applies to a lot of things that you do in life so I take this uh, teaching from source uh, sometimes when source and spiritual family guide me to a particular thing like learning even in chemistry or science in the past or uh, even in yoga I will take that learning to incorporate this in other places it's because it is universal uh, that's what sauce told me it can be used widespread everywhere and what they told me uh, was about really taking it easy and having fun a split is a daunting thing for anyone uh, who is not able to do a full split so how are you going to get into that move um, if if you are going to force yourself into it it is really stressful and crazy and you will find you're not being motivated, you're not enjoying in learning this move at all. And this applies to a lot of things in life. So 
you will notice that you're not really motivated to, for example, earn money, motivated to read a book that may be very daunting, uh, perhaps a scientific book. And to me, it is daunting. Uh, I know that for a lot of people, it gets very daunting to read a very thick book. And you have a lot of things that you'll find it very difficult. But how are you going to engage this um, this motto, this energy of take it easy and have fun. It's really just have fun while learning that move, the thing that you want to do to study and treat it. Um, don't judge yourself first and foremost. Being aware that um, being aware of what you have to do, perhaps source and spiritual family is guiding you to relax. Don't get too stiff. Don't be critical of yourself. Don't judge yourself. And being aware of that, taking it easy, and move into what they are guiding you to. And it's just very simple. So it's really not focusing a lot about uh, resistance, which is uh, resisting in the, the divine truth, which really empowers and expands you. Because thoughts such as, um, you're not really good at what you add, you're not... Um, uh, yeah, you are not successful, you are not able to get into splits, you must be very weak at this move. It's not very expanding, it's not um, contributing to your growth at all. And that is why it stems from the take it easy and having fun. So uh, for an example, it's like um, when I do yoga, I will just take it easy, I don't go to full splits. But how I learned in getting into splits and still engaging in the activity is just settling that wherever that I can, that source and spiritual family. It, is, it would be, I believe it's called an um, alternative uh, pose. So an alternative pose, most people would say that it's a weaker pose than, than if you can do a full split. And it is not the truth. Um, this has some ego in it and this is not the truth so how you're going to learn is really being okay wherever you are then it is also taking it easy and having fun um, if you if you need to judge and be critical of yourself it's very stressful in learning and you find that a lot of your learning and studying in life gets very um, just really dims now the happiness and one thing I've learned is that uh, when you incorporate happiness in your studying in whatever pose you learn in whatever uh, tasks you learn even cooking when you engage happiness joy uh, when you engage in fun taking it easy not be critical of yourself you really want to do more of it you want to continue to do more of this and and just grow and just see more of it that's why one reason why a lot of females I know uh, people whom I know really enjoy cooking uh, it's not very stressful with cooking um, baking as well as fun activities but when it comes to studying it's where um, many times in the past we get exposed to triggers uh, maybe souls or people who whom have um, placed some judgments on us and we take upon this non-truth and be very critical in themes um, source was sharing with me actually like studying studying in uh, when you are undergoing educational studying it was it is actually one of the foremost big problems um, in actually incorporating this taking in taking it easy and having fun so um, yeah this is one way I incorporate it would be in yoga um, I don't feel like I get exposed to a lot of stress stimulants and I take it easy and just really having fun so doing alternate poses as well and getting into the pose so this is one of the biggest um, life-changing motto and energy um, that source and my spiritual family actually 
has guided me to um, including the path of healing because if you are going to take uh, studying and growth and ascension very very stressfully it is really difficult uh, wherever you are at to get to maybe a place where you want to be um, and yeah so that is um, what Source and Spiritual Family is guiding me to share for today's uh, session and I will be sending a divine guidance blessing for this energy as well so it's the same as um, other videos that I've done before so if you want to accept and receive this you can just set an intention with divine spirit divine source and your spiritual family to receive it right now and I'll send it right now to you So I'm seeing quite a lot of you that is going to receive this. Uh, it will help you a lot um, in your world. So including inner healing, your inner growth, and out outwardly as well. Um, consciously, when you are aware of this, it gets much more easier to incorporate this in your world in many different ways. just sent it and um, yeah and I'm hearing actually just to clear it up what is power uh, so one thing power is actually where it expands and build on your growth um, for example if another person says uh, I appreciate you it's really coming from your heart from growth and it really builds on and expands you it doesn't uh, debil debilitate you your growth or you your inner worth as well as well as, your, as well as your work and I would refer to this as force energy um, force energy is actually um, energies that people can relate to like a guilt tripping you blaming you um, diminishing your worth uh, shame humiliation so these actually um, are not expanding you these are actually you will feel a contraction um, and when you feel this way it's difficult for you to grow in your spiritual growth uh, easier analogy uh, sources guiding me to say it's like how a healthy life foods um, will expand you it will help to encourage growth encourage healthiness while for example junk food potato chips um, really a lot of ice cream the fast food will actually constrict your energy constrict your health and your growth so these are this two is an example so the first one is an analogy that uh, relates to power so power uh, emotions and energy such as such as what uh, this topic is take it easy and have fun uh, calm peace love unconditional love um, let me see courage uh, strength joy and these are all from power it will expand you it will grow you it's like eating lots of healthy nutritionist food for you as a soul and a spiritual being and as well as a physical being as well and while um, the latter just now what I mentioned um, 
an example is junk, junk food, uh, fast food, that actually constricts you. It provides a resistance to growth, to put it simply, and including growth on spiritual ascension. So when this happens, it doesn't really promote growth, if you can notice it. So take it easy and having fun is really helping and promoting growth. And you really want um, to encourage a lot of this in your world, in your life. So that's why um, the importance about this energy and about this motto saying or energy. Um, if you want to integrate in your life if this, uh, it is great, of course. Uh, it can help you immensely in many different ways. So that is, uh, that is all, and the energy has been sent, so it will begin to work immediately for anyone who have received it. So thank you everyone, thank you so much for joining me today, bye bye.